Hi, uh, this is uh, John Podgorski, freemarketingtoolshelp.com. Uh, in this short video, I'll show you how to create banner um, for free. Uh, I use a um, service um, provided by Ad Creator, and uh, this is the, their homepage. And uh, I'm actually already logged in. It's very easy to create uh, images and um, other um, designs for your online marketing. Uh, all of them you can use for free except squeeze pages. To create squeeze pages, you have to be upgraded uh, member. Uh, in this video, I'll show you how to create um, basic banner. Uh, browse templates, click here. As you can see, there's just a large number of different uh, graphics and, and some of the uh, banners or uh, header graphics are already uh, created. There's just lots of stuff that you can choose from and and if you're marketing, uh, this is a really reliable tool and also you don't have to worry about um, up, uh, uploading it to um, your hosting. Everything is done for you um, once you create your uh, banner uh, just have to copy the URL and uh, um, just implement the uh, banner to different uh, marketing tools to, to have your advertising showing uh, in this case uh, 468 by 60 banner click here and uh, as you can see, there's lots of different templates that you can choose from. Uh, you can choose the white one if you want to do it from scratch with your own background and stuff. Um, you can use uh, already pre-made banners, just add tags to it, and uh, that's it. Uh, let's go to page number four. Uh, I'll show you one of the uh, templates that uh, I like. Um, Okay, if you choose your uh, design, just click on it and this should load into uh, Designer so you can uh, make changes, add text. Yeah, this is loading. Okay, the banner is in. Um, you know, first, uh, I just want to say that um, using uh, generic banners that uh, you have with other programs is. Um, not going to convert very well. If you have your own banner with your own picture or your own logo, uh, this will uh, work for you much better and uh, conversions will be much better because um, there are banners that people see over and over and over again and they never click on them. But if you have your own uh, custom banner, that will actually work for you better. Uh, so I recommend to, uh, to do, uh, you know, uh, to upload uh, your own picture or, or logo and uh, this way you can uh, build uh, credibility and, and uh, build your own uh, brand uh, so uh, people once they trust you people actually um, click on your banners uh, okay uh, let's choose the smaller picture I have two different sizes here and uh, if you upload the picture uh, it's actually larger than it's supposed to be so just have to resize it in each corner you have a little uh, square box that you can just drag it and uh, and reposition the uh, the picture um, okay so it's very simple if you have a really really large picture I would, I would recommend uh, resizing it before you actually upload it here so this will make it uh, much easier for you and uh, will be um, less work in the uh, creator because sometimes uh, you know there's lots of people using the service and sometimes it just uh, takes a little bit longer um, for the uh, tool to, to, to work but um, if let's say uh, we'll click um, let's maybe do text okay um, this actually um, you can move um, so the picture will be still showing and uh, you can grab one of the uh, corners and resize it, make it larger. I'm um, actually leaving leaving some space for another graphic that I'll upload in just a moment. But uh, yeah, 
you need to uh, double click this text once you have the uh, cursor uh, you can delete uh, the existing text and put your own And you can click here to center your text. And um, also you can change the color by going here. And I know that uh, yellow color works very well with uh, um, red background. So we'll just change it. And uh, let's change the font um, to make it more uh, visible. just uh, change the font to a little bit smaller one okay let's make it 17 uh, it's still a little bit too large um, you just have to play with it a little bit and uh, once you get used to it it will um, work for you uh, much faster you, you'll be able to make the changes faster um, so this is uh, basic uh, text that we put in and uh, let's put another um, stuff and maybe we'll put click here button on this uh, banner so this is a click here button and uh, also um, you can put text on it so basically click uh, text again once you have the text loaded um, and you have the cursor you can uh, edit this and um, we, we are going to put click here Let's make it um, more compact. Um, and just have to move it uh, to the right location. Okay, and uh, your banner is ready. Um, basically, you don't. Um, uh, you have to uh, play with uh, the text uh, and uh, uh, adjust it to the right sizes. Uh, for me, it's a little bit harder here because I'm using Camtasia uh, recording uh, and uh, this uh, is not really working 100% with me. But uh, once you log into a creator, you, uh, you'll be able to uh, make lots of changes. And uh, let me show you, if you, if you uh, want to delete something, just click on that and uh, uh, click the uh, delete button this will delete uh, the portion that you would like to uh, change and uh, remove from your uh, um, banner and uh, I'll show you how to save it it's uh, very simple uh, on the other side of this page um, see um, right here um, save and continue click on this. Uh, I normally use GIF. Uh, this actually loads a little bit faster than JPEG but you can experiment. You can always uh, change it to different uh, extension. Uh, save banner. You can name it also um, so this way you know which one is which and uh, once you have lots of designs it's probably a good idea to uh, name your banner. And this is it. Uh, the banner is here. If you click on it
you, you'll be able to see it and uh, Okay, um, this is the ban uh, the uh, banner we just created. This is the uh, URL uh, where uh, the uh, banner is stored. So if you click on it, um, it should take you to the URL. Um, and uh, let me just move it so you, you actually see it. Um, so you can see uh, the same URL and the banner is already live. Um, making changes is very simple, very fast, and uh, basically you just have to save it again. Uh, if you make changes to the banner or any um, design on the Ad Creator, making changes is, is very simple, very easy. And uh, if you click here, you'll be able to see it. You know, this is the banner we just created. Uh, in next uh, short video, I'll show you how to uh, implement this banner into um, your uh, safe list. You can use the banner on uh, many different uh, uh, advertising platforms, and uh, um, I use safe list, uh, a lot because uh, they bring lots of traffic and uh, uh, they are free to use. So uh, I'll show you uh, in next uh, video how to uh, put your banner on your safe list. This is actually um, hands-free advertising because the banner will be showing every time someone is trying to um, earn credits and uh, you don't have to uh, send advertising um, specifically to show this banner. The banner will be showing on um, on the home page of uh, each safe list and sub pages, uh, pages that people open to earn credits. Uh, thank you so much for viewing this video. Um, I'm, sh I'm pretty sorry it's uh, not uh, working out uh, with me the way it should because uh, the recording um, software is kind of making it slow. And uh, But uh, once you uh, sign up for free account with Ad Creator, you'll be able to um, to make changes and, and uh, create your banners really quickly. There's lots of other stuff that you can use uh, Ad Creator with uh, uh, splash uh, pages, um, uh, squeeze pages if you upgrade a member, um, peel away pages. Um, there's just lots of stuff that uh, you can you can use, um, and uh, you don't have to be upgraded member to create uh, banners like this. Okay, thank you so much. Thanks for viewing this video, and I'll show you next one uh, shortly. Thanks.